After hearing Shara tell me's story about Halloween, I decided to travel in search of Princess Lilla, to ask her about the planet Earth. When I went to collect my ship from the workshop, they told me that the warp engine was damaged. It must have been due to my last expedition, where there was a space-time anomaly. As we studied at the university, the warp engine creates a curve in space-time, expanding it behind and contracting it in front, so that the ship is propelled by this movement without any action on its part. It's like placing a ball on a pool of water and creating movements in the water to move it. Space is the water, and the ship is the ball. That's why we can travel great distances to stars that we cannot even see with our eyes, without the need for fuel, as was done thousands of years ago. With no ship and nothing to do, I returned home. I found something terrible upon arriving there. A letter from the Royal Mail. Special and urgent summons to all the Lillas of Lilliland. With this extraordinary summons, all the Lillas of the universe are called upon. Please attend immediately on the sixth day of the ninth month of the current stellar year, at the usual place on planet Arano. If you do not have a spacecraft to travel, we have special transport available for this occasion. Signed, Princess Lilla. I can imagine what is happening. Princess Lilla has spent about 300 years developing an enormous sense of boredom, which is leading her to a terrible situation. A situation that led her to distance herself from all of us. Until now. Boredom is normal and healthy, but the princess's boredom causes turbulence in our system and could make the laws of physics, as we know them, change unpredictably. I have to prepare for the journey. See you soon.